The North Carolina Digital Collections Tips to Get Started If you've never used the Digital Collections, this video will help you get started with a few essential tips. The North Carolina Digital Collections is a treasure trove of material from the State Archives and the State Library of North Carolina, valuable for anyone interested in North Carolina genealogy, state history, local history, or government information. A few quick search tips and a bit of knowledge about the collections can help you zero in on the material you're looking for. These tips can also help you get better at searching for material in other library and archives digital collections around the web. The North Carolina Digital Collections contains a lot of different types of materials, including historical photographs, contemporary photographs, books, magazines, state publications, maps, newspapers, government reports, diaries, posters, log books, state treasures, governor's materials, and links to government information resources. These materials are divided into over 30 collections, all of which you can search from the North Carolina Digital Collections portal. You can search each collection by itself or you can search them together. Here is the Digital Collections homepage. To search all the collections together, Enter your search term in the search box at the top of the home page. This box performs the broadest possible searches, looking for your search term across all collections and looking at every bit of information for each item, including the title, multiple keyword fields, and the full text inside the documents. But this search box isn't very sophisticated. You can't use it to search for exact phrases to search in specific fields or to create complex searches. For many searches, it's best to begin with an advanced search where you have the ability to create specific and complex searches. In the advanced search drop-down, you can specify whether you'd like to search for your terms as an exact phrase, whether you'd like to search within a specific keyword field, and you can combine multiple search terms and phrases. In this search, I've searched for the exact phrase Miriam Stevens across all fields and the word Bible in the format field. I combined my two searches with and. If I'd used or, the search engine would have returned everything that mentions Miriam Stevens or all of the Bible records. So I'd get Bible records that don't have anything to do with Miriam Stevens, and I'd get material related to Miriam Stevens that are in formats other than Bible records. By connecting my terms with AND, I'm making sure that I only get items that do both, items that mention Miriam Stevens and are Bibles. By searching for Miriam Stevens as an exact phrase, I am excluding any items that have her name in a different order, for example, Stevens Miriam, or is spelled in a different way. So here are my results. I got one item, AB in Miriam Stevens Family Bible Records. When I click on this item's title, I'm brought to the item page. Here I can see that it contains two pages of the Family Bible recording family births. Sometimes though, your search returns too many items like this search for Stevens that returned 2032 results. When this happens, you can use the filters on the left hand side of the screen or the advanced search drop down to filter and modify your search. If you don't know what terms to put in the advanced search box, look at the filters on the left. If you click on a filter, you'll be shown the top 10 values for that field within your search. If you'd like to see even more values, click the More button that's in blue at the bottom. Click on any of the values to filter your search. If I click on Bible Records, my 2,000 results will be filtered down to 8 results. All of my 8 results are Bibles with the surname Stevens in the title, the keywords, or within the full text. Thanks for watching the North Carolina Digital Collections tutorial tips to get started. Please feel free to contact us with any questions.